is doing the same thing every day. It's like similar to more of a restaurant style where everything's made fresh every day. The way we built the bakery, it's basically, we get this much of something, we process it, we use it. If I have a lot of lemon, then I serve lemon for a day or two and then it's gone. And then it's the next thing. We don't treat any product different than the next product. If it's quiche, we shoot to make the best quiche you've ever had. If it's scones, it's, we want it to be the best scone. That boils down to just no shortcuts. Shortcuts do change the end product. I could use some shortcuts, it would help me, but then at the same time, the product that I've produced, things wouldn't be as fresh. The whole thing started with less equipment, handmade, and when you work in small batches, you're working with your hands more. The idea of everything being touched each one differs a little bit because there is the hands touching it. Not that one tastes different than the other, but so it's not the same thing every day like a factory. Yeah, being in our own space is good. It's a non-stop work in progress. You know, it'll take, there's always something around you see every day that you want to work on. You might want to add or take away. It's been good. At, at first it was like weird to jam another bakery into a new space. Um, it took a while, like a lot of moving stuff around. But the more work you put in, the more you're building it for it to become smoother and more well oiled. My name is Matt Tinder of Saboteur Bakery. Moved here from San Francisco. I am formerly a restaurant pastry chef slash idea guy. <laughs>